Today we're going to be doing a discussion. Today's discussion is about the Dragon Ball Fortnite event. I said a few days ago when we uh, did a video speculating on what was going to be in it, we'd talk about it again. So we're doing that right now. Um, first of all, I want to point out, I didn't read too many of the leaks. I made complete guesses on what the items were going to be. And I fucking <laughs> got it right. Nimbus Cloud as a glider. Fucking yep. Saiyan Pod as a glider. Um, mm -hmm. the capsules, the, uh, the superpowers, I speculated they might have superpowers again. Like, there were so many speculations I got right, the power pole as a pickaxe. It's crazy. Yeah. It's crazy that they <laughs> fucking read my mind. You got something right too, though, because you thought, yeah. uh, Beerus and Bulma might be included. And they did. We, we of course mm -hmm. got some characters wrong, but there can always be yeah. that for the next uh, wave of this, because this isn't going to be the only wave. They're going to do another wave eventually. I think they'll probably include at least Frieza in the next wave, but we'll just have to wait on and see on that. Yeah, I think I the next it... wave will definitely be villains. I, I'm going to be honest, I figured Frieza would be, if they were going to include a villain in the first wave, it would be, well, I guess he's not really a Dylan is he? He's just... I I wasn't actually expecting Beerus to be in this one. I, I think but Beerus I think is a good cool choice. That he's, I think he's yeah. a really good choice. So Yeah, I like Beerus as a character. He's fun. The first thing I want to point out is that um, when it comes to the Dragon Ball models, they are based off of the models that were used for Dragon Ball Super Broly. And mm -hmm. I really like the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie, so I think these characters came out really <laughs> cute looking. I think Beerus yeah. is definitely the best looking of all of them. Goku and Vegeta kind of have uncanny face syndrome sometime, but they came out as good as they could for Fortnite. And Bulma, spot on on <laughs> that one. Uh, she's definitely the most accurate, but I really like the more cuter Beerus that they have in this game. <laughs> um, we didn't understand fully what was going to happen. We were hoping there'd be Dragon Balls. There are Dragon yeah. Balls, and the Dragon Balls will get you a Shinron-themed glider. And yeah. the quests are I... like a separate battle pass all together that you have to mm -hmm. grind through to get the Dragon Balls. You don't physically find the Dragon Balls on the stage like we speculated, but you are collecting Dragon Balls. Yeah. The Dragon Balls seem to be, like, you get sprays. And the sprays and emotes you get in this other battle pass each account as a Dragon Ball. And once you complete it, you get the Shinron back, or the Shinron glider. So, one of the coolest seasons of Fortnite before this was the Marvel event, the OG Marvel mm -hmm. event. And in the Marvel event, there would be superhero coins that would fall down from the sky. In this yeah. Fortnite event, and I suggest you play it now if you're not playing, because this is free content. Uh, right now, capsules will fall from the sky, and they'll have a Kamehameha and a Nimbus Cloud. What sucks about the Kamehameha is you only get three blasts before they're gone, but the Nimbus Cloud is unlimited. Yeah. It just has a 20-second cool-off timer, which isn't that bad. It really isn't. It could be a whole lot worse. Very true. It's just in those last moments when it's just a few people left, it just seems like it takes forever. <laughs> Well, but the superhero really stuff was really broken, so I understand why <laughs> they nerfed this. The Goku Kamehameha, yeah. it's always Goku's voice, which is kind of lame. And um, <laughs> it works like the Unibeam did for Tony Stark during the Marvel event. So it's really good, really powerful. I like this. I like this battle pass. I think it's really yeah. fun. I think this is better than the Naruto stuff. I don't think the Naruto <laughs> stuff had its own dedicated battle pass. I don't think it did. It might have, but it's been a while. I don't think it did, though. So, I'm loving the Dragon Ball event. I think that <laughs> it's perfectly executed. I'm hyped to see more of it. And uh, yeah. we are definitely having a hell of a time. It got us right back into this game, which oh, we had been sleeping on this game for a couple months because there really hasn't been anything going on in this game. No. So, there's, we've been playing games like Multiverses. We've yeah. been playing stuff like Multiverses and Valorant and uh, mm -hmm. other games because uh, this game has just been kind of meh. Like, yeah. the Star Wars stuff wasn't that good. The Spider-Man stuff wasn't that good. So what's even yeah. the point of fucking around with it? Exactly. And so. the stuff they're doing in the world is just kind of whatever as well. 
So this was a wonderful thing. I love the Dragon <laughs> Ball pack backpack. I think that um, the character prices are a bit stupid. I don't want to get into that, though, because <laughs> everyone has problems with the economies and video games. But I think that yeah. you could have priced it a little bit better. And with the Vegeta Bulma bundle, you could have gave Vegeta his glider. That's kind of bold that you didn't include Vegeta's glider with him. You made that a buy separately thing, but you included Goku's glider with him. Yeah, kind of, messed kind of a up. dick move. Yeah. But other than that, this turned out perfectly. It's mm -hmm. playing perfectly, and we're having mm -hmm. a hell of a lot of fun with it. Oh, there's something that was added in that I was honestly kind of surprised about, but I kind of like, is that they added in Master Roshi's turtle back as a backpack and his pole as a uh, pickaxe. Not his pole, his cane as a pickaxe. Yeah, I'm glad that Roshi got some cute. representation. That can be added to Goku, yeah. though, because Goku did wear mm -hmm. the, uh, the uh, turtle shell when he was training <laughs> as a kid. So, yeah. that's a cool inclusion.